Yeah, I think I'm extremely grateful to be here. Firstly, um, yeah, well, great club, great history, great culture, and um, yeah, club that uh, strives on playing attractive rugby and uh, a club that's, that's winning games. That's ultimately what, what why you go to a place to play winning rugby and to win. And I'm yeah, excited to be here. Extremely grateful. And so uh, just after school, I went to the Bulls. I played the junior levels and senior levels, and then I made my way to Chikwas uh, and Kimberley. They played for another three years, and then um, yeah, the past two years I was in Nelspet at the Pumas in Pumalanga, where I played for the Pumas, and um, yeah, now I found myself in in Wales and yeah, striving to to put on the card of jersey for the first time. Um, I, th I think I said it during the, the um, when I was still in South Africa as well. I think when we in 2022 when we won the Curry Cup. I think it was a, a big thing for, for, for us as players and as a team to really step up in the 2023 season as well. I think the boys stuck together and um, yeah, we just started believing that you can actually go and uh, play attractive rugby again, winning rugby. And the culture was good and we really yeah, we stuck together and made it to a final again. So, um, yeah, top point scorer for Flav. Can't say anything about that. If the forward score their tries and the guys finish off, it makes it extremely uh, uh, easy for me to, to be. Uh, Top point scorers, so yeah, please, please with the team and um, yeah, all credit to them. <laughs> I've been asked this, this question before. I think um, it's an extremely difficult question. Obviously, you sort of say I'm kicking fly for more attack of uh, fly, and I think um, I think there's a good balance between the two. So in the past, where I was more kicking fly, now I tend to be more of an attacking fly, but just to find a good balance between the two. I think every team need, uh, wants or needs a fly that can direct the game for them. Game management obviously important and obviously putting your kicks to the poles. So finding a good balance between those three, four aspects, I think that's an all-round good player. That's something that I wanted to, to prove to myself. I think um, fly kicking with two right and left foot boots, it just makes it easy for yourself. And sometimes uh, you have to rely on the lefty and if, if he's in, in for a good day then all the forwards are smiling as well. So yeah, it's nice. I think firstly, obviously, just arrived today. So firstly, just to get get going with the boys. I think um, we spoke about culture and just buying into a system that really works at the stadium um, at this moment. And I think, yeah, just being here, um, I think convincing the boys as well that I'm, I'm here to, to, to play rugby. I'm not here for vacation. I'm not here to, to prove anybody wrong or right. I'm here to work hard with them. Um, obviously my first URC se season for me, so I know how to work hard. In South Africa we really train hard, so really stepping up with the boys and then obviously just getting together, having a feel for each other. Now obviously I think all the players that have been here um, obviously tells a story. So um, I've watched um, a lot of Cardiff's games, um, Cardiff, uh, Cardiff Arms Park, next to the Principality Stadium, um, rich culture, I mean... <laughs> There's a lot of guys, um, Josh Navidi obviously retired now, love watching him play, um, Sam Warburton, then you've got uh, John Olomo, so obviously that's just three names out of a, out of a, a big bunch of players, so um, yeah, excited and um, yeah, I've been watching Carter for a long time and I'm just grateful to be here.